I am so excited. It's our first Fonda tonight, everybody. We've never had a Fonda before. And now we've got our first one. I would uh, typically just do a regular intro for this fella, but there's actual, uh, there's a Peter Fonda tribute album that was put out, and uh, there's a poem on it. So I'm just going to read you what they say Peter Fonda is, and that's how I'll introduce Peter Fonda, ladies and gentlemen. Peter Fonda is a turn on, he is a burnout. He is a messiah, he is a pariah, he is a fad setter, he will not get better, he is finite like last night, unlike stage fright. Ladies and gentlemen, Peter Fonda. Peter Fonda! The penis is mine. Oh my God. <laughs> and the fashion coordinator for my, my outfit this evening is Duff. You all know her. Hmm. Peter Fonda, ladies and gentlemen, how lovely. Please sit I down, will sir. I get better. I refuse to get better, John. Why get better? You don't have to get better. You are better, for God's sakes. And I'm. No, I'm... I want to be sick. It's, it's more fun being sick. Being sick? Oh God. Are you kind sick. of a sick fella? No, I'm not. I'm so damn wholesome. <laughs> wholesome, you know. I'm wholesome. Was that a slip or what? No, you're wholesome. Uh, wholesome. Hmm. You kept the long hair, though. That's a nice touch. Oh, I. That's, I that's, All right. Me. I didn't mean sudden camera moves. I know I'm a pro, but what the. Here we go. <laughs> Tonight. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Tonight, Mr. Fun is letting this freak flag fly. So we all remember our dear friend David Crosby, who did find a liver, thank God. We pray that he makes it, because I'm serious. He had to cut his off when they got him in Huntsville. His I've hair, never not cut his liver. Mine off. When you see me in short hair, you know it's a wig. <clears throat> Sit down! <laughs> <laughs> no, that's fine. Whoa. Bad dog. <laughs> bad dog is what they call me. You're, you're the first guest dog. who's marked our set. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, did I put my boots? No, oh, my. you didn't. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. I could say penis, though. It is mine, it's not Dwight's. You've been That's running through every word so far. Is there anything left to say? Um, um, uh, yeah. What else? Do not back up. Severe tar damage. All right. Yeah. I don't have a car. Well, you live in New York. You shouldn't have a car. That doesn't matter, though, does it? What, New do you York have a motorcycle? I have you have a motorcycle. Yeah. Didn't have... you do some, uh, what did you do the other day? Uh, some I ride did... with Mary Hart or something? What was that charity <laughs> thing? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying she was on your bike. George I'm just saying she was there. 45. I'm 54 and I'm faster. I'm not as big as this and I'm faster. All right. I did 21,000 motorcyclists got together uh, and rode uh, 50 miles to Lake Estate outside Los Angeles. Jackson Brown was our band with special guests. One of them was Bruce Springsteen. Wow. Wow. This is the way to put on an event. We had 21,000 motorcyclists. We raised 1.27 million bucks for muscular dystrophy. Woo! Nicely done. Very nicely done. And it all... And it all... <laughs> <laughs> Stay away from your mic. And, and, it, and it all... <laughs> I can't. I mean, I'm... <laughs> Uh, and it all Man, is you make me want to go to a 7-Eleven. I'm is. getting a contact high from you. Do you realize that? <laughs> Here. I know, I, you I know. I want to go get some money. John, uh, Wait, what do you have? You know, you know was it Tom Jones who uses a sock, right? Nah, I use a bottle of water. All right. Hey, come on now. We're doing a program here. Are you still riding your Harley? Are you still Absolutely. out there all the time? And yeah, people say, do you have horses? <laughs> oh, no, I'm not a fool. I'm you don't not, have horses? I got two motorcycles, two fat boys. Right, and you take it up to the woods and hang out there and... No, well, I do actually drive into Yellowstone. I, I live 41 miles north of Yellowstone Park. All right. I got a lot of ass in here, don't I? You do. Let's take a little high off that, boys. Hmm? Hear that? Drive I hear that. Right. Okay, cool. I don't hear this. Do you hear nah, anything else? Enough, no. <laughs> Any, uh... Yeah, yeah, I, I, I do. I, I, my God, I, I do it. It, it, it says... Oh, I can't tell you what it says. Might be coming from the toaster. No, be very it, careful. It said, it says, I know what it's like to be dead. Who oh, put man. all those things in your head and Peter? you're making me feel like I've never been born. Can I tell you something? I wish when you were I my dad like nobody's business. You have no idea. <laughs> oh, we got to take a commercial break. We're going to be back with Peter Fonda after this. Stick around.
Nice to see you back. Uh, I am here with actor and outdoorsman Peter Fonda. <laughs> outdoorsman, I say. You hear me? <laughs> yes, outdoorsman. You are an outdoorsman. I live uh, just right on the Yellowstone River, 41 miles north of the Yellowstone Park. You in, go fishing. In Montana. I go fishing. I go fishing in the park. I ride my Harley. Right. And I got the waders on, the fly vest, this little uh, rod, a seven piece fly rod by Hardy called the Smuggler. Already I like this rod, you know, the Smuggler. The Smuggler, yes. And I pop into this place, it's called Upper Slough Creek, Silver Tip Meadow. And this one time I came in, there was two Eddie Bauer Broncos. These are a special Bronco, if you guys don't know about them. And they're made in the Eddie Bauer colors, you know, tan and green. And these netty, Eddie Orvis, Eddie stuff, you know. I'm on the, on the Harley. <laughs> Was it I running when fish. you were doing that, or oh, you were just sitting on it doing that? I'll, 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 but I'll do that. I, I'll, I'll do that too. Oh, right. I mean, I bark at my daughter on the phone. It's easy for me to do that. All right. But uh, I go out there and fish with them. You know, I'll have to catch 35 fish in an hour and a half. Wow. And each time I catch, and these are big fish. Back in Silver Tip Meadow, it's called Upper Slough Creek in the, in the park, and it's, I fish with barbless hooks. There are no barbless boats, however. Remember that. Yeah. And uh, every time I catch a fish, you put it on the back. It doesn't move. Take the hook out. I go oh, see you, see you, see you, see it, screaming and yelling, and put the fish back. Finally, one of these Eddie Bauer. Uh, other fisher guys. Politically correct people. Uh, come and say, what are you yelling at? It's showing you're catching more fish. That's really foolish. Cool. No, no, man. You don't see the bears? Bears? That's what he said. said yeah. No. <laughs> Do you realize why this is called Silver Tip Meadow? This is where the Silver Tip Grizzlies live. I'm just showing them, no, I'm not taking your food. I'm, putting, I'm just checking it out. I'm the inspector, putting it back in. As a matter of fact, it's time for me to go now because they'll be out here looking for their food. Oh, by the way, this is way pretty up, A67. I bought it for myself because I'd ridden Easy Rider and wait, I knew Wait, 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 you can't just do that to us. You want to see what we can Our do Our minds to are us? not going in the same direction as your mind. You can't just change the channel like that. You I can't mean, go fish, 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 I mean, watch. You can't do that. That's not allowed. You've got to go fish, 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 end of fish story. I'd like to talk about my watch now. I'd like to talk about my watch. No, nope, I've decided you can't talk about the watch. I oh, want to get into Easy bad. Rider stuff before I get good, to that. Good, good. That's good. I want, to, I want to know what you think. You've obviously still fighting a man. We can do this. Still one. out there day to day. This is cool. Huh? What do you think about, about uh, Dennis Hopper? Do you guys still get together and, uh, and hang out still? Does he still hang out? Um, I see Dennis from time to time. He and I have a very bizarre love-hate relationship. I can't imagine. <laughs> <laughs> Let me put it this way. There you guys are, right there. There, right there. Easy ride. Easy oh, ride. Does see what I'm doing? What's he doing? He's bitching and moaning. <laughs> hey, man, you know, man. I mean, man, man, you know, man. This is freedom, man. I mean, you know, man. We ain't no traveling service, man. It's their food, man. Well, you know, tell them to get together. And I go, yeah, you bet. No. Uh, <laughs> Hopper wears a uh, um, diamond pinky ring, smokes cigars, and voted for Dan Quayle. What do you oh. need to know? Oh, all right. So it's, it's, a, it's a different What scene a tragedy. <laughs> I still fly the freak flag. The hell with it. Well, you live in Montana. Well, thank you. Thanks, Oh, God. Everybody. Wait a minute. That's it. I'm cutting mine off. I just looked out and I see all the long hairs. Wait, I'm getting too politically correct. This is it. You're going to have to cut yours off? Absolutely. I've got a ponytail that starts on in my penis. back and goes down. It's, uh, yeah. <laughs> it starts on the thing. I have a tongue extension. It's really interesting. I don't want to yeah. hear about this. <laughs> What's the new movie you're doing? Uh, I'm starting a preparation of a film I'm going to shoot at the beginning of next year. It's called Sons of Guns. It's a spaghetti western. But coming up, uh, opening here on Wednesday the 23rd in Los Angeles and in Austin, there's a real far out opening, uh, <laughs> is a film called Love in a 45. All right, Love in a 45. Yeah, and we, got a, we got a clip of it. Dynamic. <laughs> Should we show the clip or I'd rather just talk to you if that's all right with you? Well, is the clip showing me in it? Yeah, we'll show you in the clip. All right, no, here he is. I should say if the, ship, if the clip, we'll get to clipper chips after this. <laughs> and now, <laughs> pre yuppie, <laughs> 67, my old box. I don't know why. I, I want to hang out with you and listen to Pink Floyd. I don't know why. Praise the Lord. So that's Love in a 45. Well, no, there's about um, 82 more minutes. <laughs> 82 more minutes. All right. You know, talk it's like great that to come in movie. one week, steal a show, get out of there. It's cool. Let me ask you this. Are mm. your kids straight-laced? Are they, like, uh, when you were raising them, do they go, Dad, you know, we want to go out and, <laughs> I, I, I don't told know, my son, drink My oldest son, Justin, I, I said to him at one point, you know, son, 
girls like to have sex too, you know, without a big commitment. There what? Are, he said, Dad, I've got to make a call, excuse me. <laughs> but he, he was absolutely outraged. He thought I was an immoral person, you know, because I was telling him, because I knew this is what he needed, you know. Right. <laughs> was he a little too cranky? Too tight. Yeah. You know, how, how old was he? Got the semen built up, got to the kid. You know? Yeah. How, how old was he at the time? Oh, 24 or 5. No, oh, 20. you're right. Yeah, no, you're right. I'm sorry. I didn't realize. Well, well it, it, no, he wasn't a virgin, but it was, he just didn't understand what it was, you know. Don't laugh back up. Severe tire damage. <laughs> anyway. All right. My daughter, when she said, I'm in school, my daughter, has anybody ever seen my daughter? I mean, for 40 some odd years, I was known as That'd Henry be, Fonda's right. son. Right. <laughs> For the, next 20, <laughs> uh -oh. for the next 20 years, I'll be known as Bridget Fonda's father. I understand that one. I'm all for it. Bridget's really cool. Bridget said to me when she graduated from high school, Dad, I want to be an actor. I said, don't you ever say that to me again. Oh. Dad, I said, it's a verb, not a noun. Where are you going to study acting? UCLA? I said, fat chance. You're going to Princeton, Yale? Oh, no. And then you started crying? <laughs> I'm going to send my daughter to Needle Park. <laughs> Am I too close to the mic? Oh. <laughs> I'm going to send it. NYU said NYU because they are the hippest. They've got, you have. Uh, I think we have to go now. I think we have to, I think I know we have that to go song. to commercial. I think I should go now. Peter Fonda, it is a pleasure to meet you. I feel like my mind is going in slow motion right now. And you, sir, are just flying out there. And Let thank me roll you so my tongue back by. up so I can get out the show easily. Hey, mm -hmm. listen, take this album. This is the Peter Fonda tribute album. I can't you believe can it. have that and take that and listen to it at home. Would thank you, you very much for joining until, us. No, I won't oh kiss you. Oh, God. But you did a makeup is love in a 45, I know. Still to come, Jack A. Harry, Mark Marin, and musical guest live. Stick around, everybody. Oh. Oh.